is Dr. T. I'm here with Tara. How are you? Hey, I'm good. June 19th. We're going to be out supporting uh, Do It For Dads, Walk and Run, uh, for Prostate Cancer Canada. And we are wearing extra small t-shirts. Okay. So, a lot of times, like, you know, but people feel like a lot of stiffness and tightness in mm -hmm. their hip flexors and in their hamstrings. So, what we wanted to do is, like, maybe to offer you guys a different perspective and maybe what you're feeling is a byproduct of weakness in the hamstrings and the hip flexors. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to demo a couple of moves and then we'll be able to go from there. Yeah. So, the first one is, I'm going to put myself in a lunge position. I'm going to squeeze my glutes and I'm going to shift myself, translate myself forward. I want to be able to maintain that integrity of the glute contraction. And then you really be able to isolate that stiffness and the tightness. Okay. Like that. Okay? Try that. Now, I'm not a big fan of actually sticking your hands there. You want to be able to also work your balance, squeeze, and then go forward. And you should feel it right there. Mm -hmm. Okay? How's that feel? Feels good. All right. Now, the second thing is hamstrings, right? Everybody has this chronic stiffness and tightness in their hamstrings, but let's build a little bit more strength into the hamstrings and then we'll be able to, again, to demo this move. Again, it's also going to be able to activate your core as well. So, I'm going to get back down here. I'm going to come up. I'm going to lift one leg up and I'm going to go into a full extension of my knee and I'm going to come up to a bit of a flexion. And that's exactly what's going to really help me to be able to go through my gait cycle, especially that terminal phase of running. Okay? Let's try that. Okay. Okay. Good. Just like that. Beautiful. How's that feel? Good. It looks deceptively easy, but also paying attention to your wrist. So it's a great one to be able to do. Okay? Mm -hmm. You ready for one last one? Yeah, for sure. All right. So in terms of the hip flexion, one of the things that we want to be able to do, again, work on that eccentric phase of our hip flexors, right? So because we do too much of a concentric, we're constantly lifting it up, mm -hmm. right? And the slower you go, the better it is, right? Okay. The speed hides needs. Okay, so I'm going to come up and I'm going to very slowly try to bring my leg down. Again, we're going to work our balance. And we can rock a few of these, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, it works your balance. It's a really great thing to be able to do. Yeah, great. Thanks so much. Not a problem. So come and see us June 19th. Support the cause. It's really going to be awesome. Awesome, and the weather's going to be nice, and get out there and try these. Take care, guys.